After logging in, the first thing you will see is the dashboard. The dashboard contains a summary list of all tests for the day. Click Procedure Bookings. In the Procedure Booking screen, click the Visit ID for the booking you want to view. The details of the booking will be displayed. Click the Results tab. Click Mark as Processing to signify the start of the test. Once the test has been done, after the results are available, you can attach these files to the booking. To attach a file, type the file name then click Choose File. For the PCR test, you can select the testing result before ending the procedure. Review all information before ending the procedure. For the rapid testing, you can enter the IgG and IgM result as well as the cartridge number before ending the procedure. Review all information before ending the procedure. You can also book for walk-in patients. Just click New Booking from Procedure Bookings. Search and select for the name of the patient. If the patient is not in the list, they must first be registered in the system. Select the COVID test, then enter the date and time of the test. Click Save to submit the booking. After the patient has paid, you can click the Payment tab to add the patient's payment details. Add the payment details of the patient, then click Apply Payment. Once the payment has been applied, the test booking will be confirmed. To add a new patient, click Patients from the menu, then click Add New Patient. In the screen, you can add the details of the new patient to be added to the system. Take note of the following required information from the patient. If the patient does not have an email or mobile number, the next of kin can be registered instead. Then the actual patient can be added to the registered person's account. Once you're done, click Save. The patient can now be selected when creating a new booking. In the patient's list, you can click the email of the patient to edit their details as well as to add the child or adult to their account. If the rebooking is requested by a patient, you can click Rebook with Fees. Rebooking by patient is subject to 20% charge. You can enter the reason for rebooking as well as the new date and time for the test. Patients must pay the rebooking fee or else the original schedule will be retained. Rescheduling due to internal reasons can be done by clicking Reschedule. Enter the new date and time for the rescheduled procedure as well as the reason for reschedule then click Save. The new schedule will have to be confirmed by the patient or the procedure will be cancelled. In case the booking needs to be cancelled, you can click Cancel this booking. You must then select a reason for cancellation then click Submit. The patient will be refunded.
In case the patient did not show up for the test, you can click the results tab then click patient no show. The staff must wait at least 15 minutes before ending the procedure and tagging as no show. If necessary, you can send messages to the patient by going to the chat tab then typing your message in the conversations box.